Hello everyone, welcome back to the weekly 529 plan for my daughter. Balance on the account is $18,409.46. This balance is actually down from last week. The stock market didn't perform too well, which that's been her theme for the past what year and a half at this point. But let's jump into the deposits for the past week. So I just had two deposits, one on April 3rd in the amount of $56. There is a 90-10 percentage split between the two ETFs in this account. So 90% of $56 is $50.40 that went into the growth stock ETF. And then 10% of $56 is $5.06. And that went into the aggressive growth. <clears throat> and then on April 4th, I put in $25. So that's all the moolah <laughs> this mama had this week to put in to the 529. So the total contributed for the week was $81, which again, any amount of money I can put into this account, I'd be really, really happy about. And this 529 will be converted into an ABLE account, which stands for Achieving a Better Life Experience. It's an investment account for people with disabilities because my daughter does have a severe disability. And in terms of upcoming deposits, just one on April 11th, I am planning to contribute $25. I don't know if I'll have more money next week to contribute, but we just take it one week at a time, or should I say I just take it one week at a time because I'm doing this as a single parent just to see where I can conjure up some extra money to put towards um, this account and all of my other investment accounts. And year-to-date contribution on the account is $4,475. Yay, we're almost to $5,000. It's definitely going to take a couple months before this account hits $5,000. I'm not sure when, maybe sometime in July, August. But we'll see. That's the minimum balance that I'm hoping to contribute to the account for the year. But of course... I'm always aiming to contribute as much as I humanly possibly can to this account, just given that it is earmarked for my daughter's lifetime care. And that is the latest and greatest for this account. Let's just pop over to the performance. Um, the account is up $403.24. I'm giggling because... I try not to hang on to this because I'm like, next week it might be completely down and back into the negatives. So this is where it is as of this week. We'll see what happens. I'm hoping it stays in the positive because it's like the one account that I'm actually having some gains in. <laughs> Meaning that the money that I've actually put in is smaller than what the balance is. So we'll see what happens. But that is where we are right now. All right. And that's it for this week's update. I'll catch you next week. Bye.